welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is, I gotta do it, Nurse Funds. I am a full-time registered nurse. I did make a video about how much I make. Um, if you're watching this right now, I probably already posted my side hustles. I think I'm gonna make this like a story time. Should I make this a story time? So thank you guys so much for answering my questions last week. I asked you guys a few questions and one of them was, do you guys enjoy chatty videos? And a lot of you guys said you do. One of you guys said you enjoy it because it kind of gets you, um, like you get to know the person, which I completely agree with, but I feel like I ramble. So anyways, I'm going to do a quick little story time. Let's start off with our quote. There's one good thing about music. When it hits you, you feel no pain. That is by Bob Marley. I love this quote. It was actually inspired by my girl Cash Stuffing with Genesis. I actually try to look for her channel and I cannot find it. Let me know down below if you guys have, um, like, know where her channel is. So I stuff a shout out for the day is The Lethal Wife. Oh my goodness, you guys. First, let's talk about what I asked you guys last week. Last week, I asked you guys, what is your favorite and least favorite thing about the summer? And she replied, my favorite thing for the summer are the family vacations we used to do um, every July. And her least favorite thing is having to work. She said the summertime used to be so much fun. She used to hang with friends, um, no school, like back in the day when we were kids, which I totally get it <laughs> she made the comment i'm childish girl you know you're not those were good times i remember when i was a kid i was always in a rush to grow up and my uncle and my dad were going somewhere i have no idea where they were going but i guess it was for adults only and i was like i want to go my uncle was like it's for adults only and i was like i want to be an adult like i i hate being a kid and he was like my uncle is balding, so he was like, do you see this bald head? And I was like, yeah. And he was like, I have this bald head because for every single bill I paid, <laughs> one hair fell out. So I was like, okay, I'm not in a rush to be an adult. <laughs> anyway, so I got to shout out my girl, The Lethal Wife. Last week, I did do channel shout outs and I did like just a little show her channel. But you guys, I genuinely love watching her channel her vibe is just immaculate i love all of her envelopes i love um her binders i actually asked her where she got um the stickers on her binders but i can't find any that look like me i am a curly girl i was trying to look for some melanin curly girl um stickers but none of them look like me so i was like mm, they're cute but Anyway, um, yeah, I just love her vibe. My, my husband and I watch her channel together, and he's always bopping his head to her background music. I actually told her that. Um, she, you guys, she is the sweetest. She's always showing support. And you guys, you guys got to watch her. She is consistent. She posts two videos a week every Sunday and Wednesday. I'm recording this on a Wednesday, so I'm waiting for her video to come out. And I'm going to definitely watch it. You guys, I've been so tired. I've been so behind in watching videos and things, just life. And I will update you guys. But, um, yeah, she actually shouted me out in one of her most recent videos. And your girl almost shed a tear. Like, I was so teary-eyed. And I was so, like, I felt so special. Um, I also have to shout out Mystic Budgets. I love her channel. Um, I'm also going to be doing like channel shout outs like on the side here um, But yeah, so I had to shout her out because when she answered the subby shout out questions She said she can't stand the mosquitoes the humidity and the sweating. I don't know if you guys noticed last week I had this like big old red spot This was a mosquito bite. I was like girl I wish I mentioned that because that is like one of my least favorite things about this summer but yeah, um, I also love her channel. She is super supportive. Her vibe is just, every time I listen to her intro, I'm just like, ooh, ooh, like, I'm just trying to dance. All right, so we're going to start off with our pink binder. And our pink binder has our bills. I'm going to be ordering another binder because this one is getting thick. Um, this one has our monthly bills. It also has our singing funds in there. So let's start off with this one. You guys, I had something happen. Um... 
like an emergency happened so i had to pull from this is the first time i had to pull from the sinking funds but i needed cash like asap so i'm gonna be adding a little more here i'm gonna be adding 165 instead of 110 so we have 100 150 110 and 15 so quick little story time i guess so um I don't know how I'm going to do story time while I do this. Um, so I told y'all how I have this like part-time job. Um, there's like, this is so thick, you guys. Let's count this. 100, 100, 200, 250, 270, 290, 310, 320, 400, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 444. Doesn't make sense. All right. Anyway, so that part time job for a while, I so I got hired in April. Um, and I'd be counting this. Oh my gosh. Um, all right. Household is getting $60 and it's getting. According to this, a 10 and a, a 50. Yeah, I think I messed up again. I'm always doing this. Okay, so the reason, so one of my videos, I was like, I don't even know if I have that job anymore. And this is the reason why after this. <laughs> so in household, we have 50, 150, 200, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 300. The reason why was because I got hired in April and I was like so ready to start because most places if you get hired you're like most likely going to start within a month so I was so ready you know it wasn't going to be a full-time it was just I'm not leaving my full-time job because the benefits one are bomb and two I have like if you've watched where I've worked as a nurse you'll understand that I have not been loyal to these hospitals and I've been moving from hospital to hospital anyways christmas is getting 40 um so i'm like i'm trying to stay somewhere for a while plus i like my manager i love my co-workers anyway let's get to this 120 40 60 80 90 200 10 20 30 40 50 250 y'all 250 one of my goals is to bolt this up so yeah my like i really wanted to stay at a place for a while um but so i'm not leaving so um i picked up this part-time job because we are like fairly new homeowners and we have like a lot of projects we want to do and projects cost money so home is getting ten dollars 20 40 60 70 71 72 73 74 i'm gonna be buying like pillow covers with this 74 anyway so you know i didn't I was told I was going to start, um, like right away, like, um, most likely in April or May, but they weren't sure. And I told them I, I needed time to know when training was going to start because I do have full time, a full time job and I have commitments. I'm not adding to this today. So, and not an NSO either. So, okay. So then they send me a message like, maybe a week before training and they were like no not even a week before i'm giving them too much credit it was like four days before it was like all right we're gonna start training i was like i cannot like i already have i had to do acls mbls training so i was like i can't do that and then i also had like a doctor's appointment i had to go to so i was like telling them like uh i can't do that and um all right so we should have 85 in there 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85. And they're like, well, we can't be too sure um, about the campaigns. We don't know when they start. They're kind of just like availability. Like, anyways, uh, I'm trying to make this sh story as short as possible. Anyway, um, they were kind of like not, the communication, y'all, was poor. Okay gifts is getting five dollars focus 20 30 40 45 50 55 oh my gosh so 
So fast forward now, it is June, $55. It is June um, of this year. And I'm asking like, hey, when's the next training? And like, they were not. So like, even before I got like a message about training in the beginning of June, they were not responding to my calls or my emails. There was this one woman, let's call her Mary. Her name is not Mary. Um, she was not responding to me like she went ghost like it was kind of scary how like she disappeared on me so I, that's why there, that was the reason why i thought i didn't have a job because i'm like she's not responding to me and i had been like over at that point it was like over a month that she had not replied to me i was like do i need anything i had gone to do my blood test uh, my blood test and i was like y'all i didn't even turn on my you didn't even tell me. I didn't even turn on my um my ring light. I hope the lighting was good this whole time. So she was not responding to me. And dang, this light makes me look so washed out. <laughs> um, so she wasn't responding to me. So 10, 15, 20. Anyway, I thought like something had happened to her, or maybe I, you know, I just didn't have a job anymore. And Anyway, so I kept, like, leaving messages. I Legit, you guys, I left, like, 20 messages. <laughs> okay, not legit 20 messages. I think I had left, like, five. And my husband was like, just leave them be. This job is probably not meant for you. But I was, like, generally concerned. I was like, you don't just leave somebody hanging like that for a month. You told me I had the job. Like, and this job was clutch, y'all. Like, this is, I'm already working here, by the way. But this job is so clutch. You work from home. And I've never had that opportunity. Like, I'm always having to go somewhere. So I was like, this is clutch. And I have a condition where, you know, I had to stay at home for about two weeks. Um, and I'm going to fill you guys in later about that. I'm just waiting on things to settle. So, um, all right, YouTube, where is that getting? It's getting $5. So I was like, yo, you just don't leave somebody hanging like that. This is so rude. So... I was like, oh my gosh, like, what's going on? So, so YouTube is getting 10, 15, 20, 25. I'm going to do a giveaway at 500 subscribers. Thank you guys so much. I have over 300 now. Yay. Thank you so much. <laughs> um, Scrubs is getting $5. And I was like, this is crazy. Um, now I'm getting distracted. Where did I leave off? Scrubs got 10, 20. 2530. All right, this is a secret envelope. Let's do this real quick. <laughs> Nobody guessed it. They were just like asking me. I'm like, I told you guys to guess. <laughs> um, this secret envelope is getting $20. Let me see if I could block it and count. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Okay, I feel like you guys are gonna tell if I block it. It's a secret. It's a secret, secret, secret. Isn't it great? It's just a string. A secret string. Boy, when you're right, you're right. That's some secret box you got there. Yeah, thanks for showing me that. I'll probably do a little giveaway. If Maybe next week I'll come up with something. Whoever um, can tell me what it is gets a prize. All right, so 100 envelopes challenge. Um, I got nail polish on this. I am going to order a new envelope. I'm going to order a new binder so I can like do my challenges and stuff and my sinking funds. So I didn't pull any money for that, but I did pull some for, no, I didn't even pull for the $40. Oh, I, I pulled, my gosh, you guys. Well, I pulled $5 for 100 envelopes. I just don't know where it went. We'll find it, but um, yeah, so... I finally got an answer saying that I could start, but it was like at the end of June and it worked out because I was already home on vacation. So I was already home on vacation, so it worked out. So let's do this binder. This is our cash envelopes. I do carry this around with me. It does fit in my mini backpack. I explain that every week. I just don't like folding my bills. So yeah, so we're only stuffing 20 because my husband actually took the $40. Oh, I usually take 60, 20 for me and 40 for him. So yeah, anyway, um, the communication was terrible. I ended up starting 
like three weeks ago now y'all they are so messy and the communication is poor make sure that if you work somewhere brand new write down your hours that you worked because they were trying to play me they were not trying to pay me um they were like oh you worked um you worked 17 hours i was like y'all i have been like working my butt off not really because i'm not doing much like at home um it's just triaging i mean it is but it's like mentally taxing sometimes i won't lie sometimes it's exhausting dealing with people on the phone but i generally love this job and i love my co-workers over the phone too we're always chatting it up in the chat and um i have this group chat called the three amigos and you guys i've like found my best friends <laughs> um through work so um yeah like they were trying to play me over 30 hours i was like you're missing 30 hours and they're like can you provide a breakdown and i like screenshot and i also like sent them pictures of my personal planner with all the hours that i worked and they were like okay thanks we'll fix that oh my gosh all right so <laughs> beauty and health is getting 30 20 40 60 80 90 95 96 97 98 99 100 1 2 3 103 my that's not right that can't be right i don't think i took out the money that i owe myself so it is right before the pay myself back all right so yeah i guess that's like my long story short i tried to make the video before and it was like 30 minutes long going into detail but i was like my goodness like you don't just leave some that's so unprofessional to me but they are a new company so i'm trying to give them the benefit of the doubt so far the people are so nice like the managers and stuff so i do enjoy working for the company but i'm like you just don't disappear I'm like god forbid something happened to you like i'm being i'm gonna be like worried you know so 20 40 50 60 what is this spending <laughs> 60 and i owe myself $24 for the planner so you guys I had like a, a little emergency where I needed cash and um, I actually have no change so I'm going to be pulling and paying myself back just not yet we haven't gone grocery shopping we don't need to and then uh, I actually really need to go couponing um, but I haven't been able to and then my grandma's not getting anything and then take out you guys i'm so confused i messed up somewhere because i still have a lot of money left so all right take out is getting 20 dollars 20 25 26 27 i think i have about 60 dollars left and i have no idea where it's going oh my gosh this video is like 21 minutes long 20 40 60 I don't know where this is going. I guess I'll put it. I'll put um. I put forty in here into gas, and then I'm gonna put the extra twenty in Christmas. Cause one of my July goals is to bulk up the Christmas um, sinking fund. So let's do that. I am not trying to post a twenty-two minute long video. Like I know you guys said you like chatty videos, but I. I get so self-conscious about like rambling and having the video too long. I don't want to bore you guys. So, all right, I'm going to, oh, I, I messed up somewhere and I'm supposed to give my hundred envelopes challenge $5. I'm going to figure that out anyway. <laughs> I'm gonna do that off camera because your girl cannot go a week without messing up. All right, let's sanitize. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys want a subby shout out next week, I don't know what is your current favorite song slash album of all time or just right now. Right now, my favorite album is definitely her new album. I swear, you guys, I listen to it every day. I've been listening to that, and I've also been listening to Doja Cat's new album. I love Doja Cat's new song, Alone. I just love the beat. Uh, what kind of music do you guys like? Let me know down below what is your favorite album and your favorite song. Your girl's always looking to listen to new music. I'm the type of person who plays music on repeat, and 
my husband is my witness don't forget to like and comment and subscribe if you enjoyed this if you enjoyed my rambling let me know if you didn't also let me know tell me you need to shut up and just stuff those envelopes i'll get it i'm open to constructive criticism but also be nice <laughs> so i'll see you guys soon bye